<laughs> All the best, huh? Thank you. This is the best time to come to the show flat. Hey, you come here. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. announcement i'll be sharing a lot of property good news in my instagram called the huat channel do join me by subscribing to the channel hill haven by far east and suki sui house with the artist impression straight away i like this project first of all this looks like the signal tower give me a feeling that the wi-fi signal is like super strong like super speedy there's no lagging and the second thing is the project name it sounds like the movie i like tills have eyes <laughs> 341 units, TOP 2027. Now let's do a quick recap how much the developer bought the land for. Total, there are four bids and Far East got it 1.3% higher than second bidder, which means they got it at a very competitive price at 1,024 per square feet per plot ratio. So with all the costs, construction, interest, finance, build the show flat cost, and with their 15% profit, they should be selling their three bedrooms at around 2,050 per square feet. So Hugh Haven going to launch this month, 2024, and you can see that it's very near to Hillview MRT station. Every time I hear about Hillview, Never mind, i share it later. Lah. So from the side gate to Hillview MRT station, it's only 350 meters five minutes walk only. This is the type of project which is considered near MRT station. Now let's look at the site plan. It looks nice, two blocks and tennis court over here. Not tennis court, speaker court. Pop, pop, pop is causing quite a racket across the USA. Most annoying sound ever goes one tweet. It's 9.30, why are my neighbors playing pickleball goes another. Imagine hearing this all day long. The tennis ball is a lower frequency than what our ears are most sensitive to, seen in these wider sound waves, while the pickleball strike is higher pitched. You can see the narrower sound waves. So our ears catch more of the noise it makes, and the clamor is clearer from farther away. Now unit mix. Oh, they do have one beta. So starting from two beta, which consists about 53% of the entire project, which people usually buy for investment. And the rest, three, four beta, people usually buy it for own stay at 47% of the entire project. Let me show you the indicative price for each floor plan. And the smallest unit goes to two bed, two bath, six, seven, eight square feet. Very nice layout. See the kitchen. This one cannot walk here. Eh? See? Induction, cross floor, window. Very nice layout. Very nice. This is why I like about Far East. They know what people want. And instead of building too many one beders which ends up you need to build a lot of five beders and penthouse, they start from two beders. It's a very, very good strategy. It gives value to buyers. Starting from 1.4 plus million, my average is around 1.55 million, 2,290 per square feet. Oh, two, two, uh. Two bed, two bar plus study is 797 square feet. This layout quite cool because the study can be a storeroom or study area. And the kitchen, there's maybe one window here. Maybe you can walk here. Starting from 1.6 plus million, my average 1.75 million, 2,125 per square feet. To buy something for stay is usually three bed. And the smaller size, three bed, two bath, 947 square feet. Well done. This is a very perfect size, very affordable size for upgraders. The room size queen, queen, king, and closed kitchen can walk hey. Starting from 1.88 million, average 1.95 million, 2,060 per square feet. I really hope that the next layout is something good with a storeroom. Three bed, two half plus storeroom, 958 square feet. Room size queen, queen, king, and the storeroom is perfect. Can convert into a study area with a window. And closed kitchen can walk here at only 958 square feet. This is one of the most perfect way to start for 2024 because usually this kind of size developer like the West one, they will sell 1,200 square feet. You know the West one, C7 MRT tracks that one. Thomas, 
starting from 1.96 million, average 2.05 billion, 2140 per square feet. Next, something bigger, 3 bed 3 bath plus study, 1012 square feet. I don't have the starting price for this, so my guess, estimated average 2.18 million, 2150 per square feet. My wife tell me she liked the design. Very nice, I also agree. You know some shows that are not so nice, but this one, timeless lah. Can walk here. Oh, yeah. Why can walk here? Because the window at the side. 4 beta 1259 square feet, starting from 2.49 million, my average 2.6 million, 2080 per square feet. This is a very good start for 2024. You can see that Far East Sukisui house know what buyer wants, want to give more value for buyers, their floor plan. Ooh la la, perfect size. Now let's talk about whether the price is perfect or not, which is the most important thing. To know whether Hugh Haven can make money, let's check out these few projects and their performance. There are like 8 to 9 projects over here. So for good comparison, let's look at the leasehold projects. So we have the first one, the Helia, which is a mixed environment, completed in 2016. Second one, Kingsford Hillview Peak, completion 2017, which is a standard plot. And the third one, just completed Midwood in 2023. Okay, now let's start one by one. Uh. The Helia, 2016, 528 units. First glance, you see, yes, they have good, healthy transaction volume. The second thing you see, whether there are good transaction for three or four bidders, which can also tell you whether this project is family-oriented or investment-based. Most people buy here for investment. La. And for mixed development, it's about 1,005, 1,006 per square feet. And let's look at the performance. Very good, 146 profitable, but there's also 38 unprofitable. Wow, look at the losses. Ah. Wow, lose two legs, lose one arm. This one, your father kick you out, mother kick you out. And the even sadder thing, they kept it for 11 years. Eh. I'm going to give everyone a very good tip now. Today is a seller's market. If today your unit still don't perform, ah, get rid of your lousy property and sell to Ahai. Then you restructure your portfolio to buy something that you will become a giant huakui. So quickly sell your non-performing properties now. Ay, logic right. If today's seller's market you still cannot perform, ah, that means chui la. What are you waiting for, my friend? Everyone, if you think that this video has some value, remember to hit the subscribe button. Okay, let's look at the profitable transactions. Wow, this size kit for 11 years only make this. Ah. One beta kit for 3 years, okay, 45k. Ah. Ay. 11 years, 150. 11 years, 150. 11 years, 120. Wow, this kind of profit. You go home, your dog will disown you. Like lousy la yo. Woof woof woof. You don't come back la. Never mind, let's have some positive vibes. Let's go for Kingsford Hillview pick. And it's a standard plot and it's very good to compare. This whole completed 2017, 512 units, which is seven years old. Ah. From here you can see, yes, healthy transactions. Number two, not bad. Got people buy three beta, maybe a four beta, at least better than Helia. Next, look at performance. Very good, 99 profitable, 37 unprofitable. Wow, when I see all these, ah, I very sad. Leh. When you buy old Xia condo, you still lose. Ah. Chui leh. But everyone, continue to have faith. Let Eric guide you. Let's look at profits. 2 beta, 11 years, 140. Hi. Wow, you call this make money. Ah. But this unit is such a big size, 8 years. Only these ah. ah, you can see, what wow, eh, sad lah. Never mind, the good thing that I see here is there are people transacting three bedrooms at 1.2 million at 1,003 per square feet. And because this is the second floor, to be fair, let's put it 1,004 per square feet. Fair. So now we learn that a seven-year-old at Kingsford condo transacted three bedroom at 1,004 per square feet. When Hugh Haven complete in 2027, 20, that means the gap will be 10 years. 10 years gap, half lah. $500 per square feet difference, meaning the brand new launch should be selling around $1,009 per square feet to be a fair price. So anything higher, <sighs> once you learn all these tips, you will learn that, eh, that one expensive. Eh, this one undervalue, chong ah. The good news, there's a lot of good ones. It's just that you don't know only. <sighs> we have one more to compare. Before we go into Midwood, after learning the Helia, don't really perform. Kingsford Hill will pick also don't really perform. Do you even dare to go into Midwood? Let's have some faith. Let's hope.
Midwood is the best one of all. Just completed last year, 564 units. And note that this project launched on October 2019. So by now, they should have a lot of sellers with sub-sale transactions because it's more than three years of holding period. Ha! Huh? Only two profitable transactions. And the good thing, zero unprofitable transactions. And the first two bader sold with a profit of 255,000 in three years. This is the good performance for a two bader. Usually two bader performance is about 200 to 250. This is a very good profit for a two bader. And the second one is a one bader only make 54. Actually, this one lose money. Uh. Lose money, waste time, lose opportunity, kilter by three years old. Hi. <sighs> Can we all agree the winner of all the Hillview people is actually this two beta seller who made 255,000 in just three years. This is what I call the hit and run strategy. Quickly sell at this time and go and buy a better area. Everyone, as you have learned, everyone, as you have heard before, your income is the average of your five best friends. So I'm going to tell you a joke. I hope you can take it out. If one of your best friend tells you, hey, I'm going to move to Hillview, you straight away delete them from your contact list and Facebook and never meet them again. Ha 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 ha. Huh? What? It's a joke. And even on the day of the launch of Midwood, nearly 50% sold there. Then after I read further, uh, they sold 24 units of the 50 apartment release. To be fair, at the time it's a buyer's market. But even at buyer's market, you don't make money. It means the location is really bad. So actually, uh, it's 24 divided by 564. Uh, it's only 4.2% sold. Now let's summarize. For the love of the floor plans, walkable to MRT station and the shopping mall at Hill V2, I'll be giving 5. It's actually 4 plus 1. For launch pricing, if developer is going to sell at 2050 to 2001, I'll be giving 6. As this strategy, everyone, you know that I don't like this area. And for those people who attended my program, you'll know why this area don't perform. In short, I don't have the confidence that you buy this, you will make money in 3 years. As this strategy, 4. Overall service score, 5 stars. Now let's guess what is the estimated sold on launch day. I guess 30% and my wife, more positive, 40%. This is my company's number. Please do not contact us because to celebrate the launch of Hugh Haven, me and my wife is going away. I hope that eventually the buyers of Hugh Haven will make money in the next 3-4 years and if you do so the rest of the people will be voila ah.